Hello, everybody, and welcome to another episode of Five Interesting Veggie Facts. Today's vegetable was picked by Disabled and Prepping. I will leave her channel linked down in the description. And if you will, go, go check her out. And if you like what you see, please hit that subscribe button. Sure does mean a lot to her, I'm sure. And tell her I sent you. <laughs> anyway, uh, today's, her pick was spaghetti squash in particular. Well, after the past two centuries of hybridization of squash, there are a plethora of varieties. They are broken down into two categories, summer squash and winter squash. Squ summer squash are usually harvested when they're immature, when the rind is edible and tender. And winter squash has a thicker rind, which is for keeping for long periods of time. And you don't really grow it in the winter. You usually harvest it late fall, and you can store it throughout winter. That's where it gets its name from. Spaghetti squash is related to, or it is in the winter squash category. So, let's go check out five interesting facts on spaghetti squash. Number one. Originally, the squash was bitter and poisonous, but squash, but that squash was taken and dried and hollowed out and used as cups and bowls. It wasn't until, I don't know, a few thousand years later, where it was bred into being sweet and edible. Um, the North Chico people of South, Southern Peru is the one that started farming squash. Central America and North America, pretty much around like the Mexico area, is where they're thinking is where squash originated from. Number Two. Squash grew wild in Central America, but spaghetti squash was first discovered in China in 1850. Number three. It was introduced to Japan in 1921, but in 1934, the Sakata Seed Company developed and improved the flavor and taste, and uh, the burpee seed company everybody knows burpee they're the ones that got it from japan in 1936 it was slow taking popularity in america but it did bonus fact in 2017 a man named joe grew a squash that weighed 2118 pounds breaking the world record for the largest squash and that was in Rhode Island, United States. Number four. Spaghetti squash gets its name not because it tastes like spaghetti, but it's because when you cook it and scrape out the insides, it resembles the noodle and it has a very mild flavor. Number five. In 1990, a new variety called Orange Getty, or spaghetti squash that's orange, was developed in the United States and it is a uh, slightly sweeter and has a higher beta carotene content bonus fact the more yellow the squash the more flavorful it is all right everybody if you like that episode please give me a thumbs up if there's a vegetable you'd like to learn about please leave it down in the comment I'll even give you a channel a shout out or give you a shout out even if you don't have a channel. And I will see you on the next one. God bless. Peace.